You'll learn how to fix the incompatible settings error in Bluestacks. If you find this useful, consider subscribing and liking the video and let's get into this. If when you try and open up Bluestacks, you go and get this error here, let's go and get some fixes. So what you need to do is just go and press the cross and close it. Then what you want to do is either go and find the shortcut on your desktop or just go and click on search and type in uh, Bluestacks, just like so. Then right click on it and go and tap on run as administrator, just like that, and then tap yes. And quite often that's gonna go and fix your problem and Bluestacks should open up fine. However, if it didn't, don't worry, I'll get into another method. And if that did fix your problem, then what you can do is go to the shortcut, for example, this here, then right click on it and go into uh, properties. If I just find it here, properties, and then go and press on compatibility and go and locate run this program as an administrator, then press apply and press okay. And then it will run as an admin every time, which is useful. However, if that didn't work for you and you're still getting the problem, don't worry. The next fix I want to show you is by enabling something called Hyper-V and Hyper-V needs to be enabled for Bluestacks to run. So to enable it, go to the bottom and click on search and type in CMD. This will get you command prompt and right click on this and press run as administrator. You go and get a Windows security pop-up, which once again, I can't record. And then what we need to do is go and have a line which you want to go and execute. So there's gonna be um, a line in the description which you want to go and copy. I'll copy mine now. It should look something like this. Just um, to paste in here, just right click with your mouse and it should appear. And then just go and hit enter just like that. It will say enabling features and then it will say, do you want to go and restart your PC? Type Y or N type Y, which stands for yes, press enter, and your PC will then restart, and Hyper-V will then go and be enabled. After it's enabled, then try running Bluestacks as an administrator again, so I'll just type Bluestacks in, right click, and then press run as administrator, and try running it, and hopefully it will then go and open up without any problems. If you're still having problems, then it could be worth just try reinstalling Bluestacks. So to uninstall it, just tap on search and type in remove programs and it should appear here. And then wait for this to load and we can just go and search for Bluestacks just like this and here it is. And then what I'd recommend you do is go and uninstall all of them. So go over to the right and tap on the three dots and tap uninstall and you can uninstall all of them super easily. And after you've uninstalled them all, just go back to the Bluestacks website and then download the installer again. And with the installer, what you should do is before you run it, right click on it and press run as an administrator. And then hopefully it will go and install everything again. And hopefully that will go and fix your problem. If it helped you, please leave a like. 